Hello. Uh, today we're gonna review uh, one of my favorite uh, gauges. Uh, it's called a uh, glow shift tinted seven. But this glow shift brand performed pretty well so far. I already have three of different gauges installed on my vehicle and so far so good. Why I'm reviewing this? I'm reviewing it just because everybody can buy it. It's not very expensive and so far they perform uh, very very well. For me, uh, the big plus is, okay, you can customize the colors first. I'm gonna show you how. Uh, second, all the documentation is inside the box, like uh, paperwork and things like that. Very, very easy to identify the color coding of the wires. And um, it's already a couple, maybe a couple of years that I have it, multiple of my vehicle, and I can tell you vibration, temperature, humidity, and whatever else doesn't interfere with these items. I'm not sponsorized by this brand, I'm not. I'm just here to help you to choose or decide in case you have to take one of them. And I will recommend it. I strongly recommend it because they perform very, very well. Okay, let's see what is inside the box. The box, as you can see, is not that big. And, uh, seven option colors they are real uh, there is one thing that nobody said uh, one of the option uh, keep the color changing all the time so when you select that option uh, automatically the display will uh, switch within the available color whenever I'm not using that feature but in case you need it uh, is there let's take a look Inside the box, you're gonna have uh, the gauge. It's not too big. As I said before, a nice uh, paperwork with the installation guide and all the hardware you need to do the job. Okay, sometimes little extra. In this case, uh, I have here a boost gauge. How you hold, let's start first to understand how big this thing is. There is dimension, there are, sorry, dimensions and everything is explained to the assembly drawing. So if you're looking for a small gauge, this one is about 2 and 3 16 inches diameter on the OD. Uh, very comfortable, you can fit. Then let me see if I can leave this here so you guys can see. There you go. You can fit them uh, pretty much everywhere. As an option, you can have also this uh, shadow or reflex screen. It works pretty good. Easy to do it. You just slide it in. It's a tight fit. A little interference fit so when you got it it stay no big deal the back is very clean it's not cheap made it has uh, retaining for the hardware for the wire in this case because it's a boost uh, gauge has uh, the entry of the inlet for the presser is an orifice so it doesn't jump all over the place when you record or when you feel the pressure coming into it, it has a couple of uh, thread uh, rod or studs or session, whatever you want to call it, with these available uh, bolts plus the bracket. So you can mount it whenever the case will be. Uh, nice feature of the silicon tubing. It's enough probably to do any major or any standard application of it. Now, why I'm spending the time to say that I'm not going too deep into it. What I want to show you is this, uh, the color coding of the wire, of 
on the electrical hardware is very very clear uh, the location is very convenient so when you install it there will be no pinching uh, not any other crazy things all the labor are there I don't have a 12 volt power supply to show you how but uh, basically when you're pushing this little button right here you're gonna switch uh, the display colors display color very very brilliant very bright the reading is clear the uh, the indicator as we said here is how it look like so this is how it look like at the end I can guarantee you that it's pretty good uh, on my Nissan everything works so far the price the price is uh, very reasonable I don't want to go against anybody but I think it's about you're gonna play within depend on what you buy you know what I mean you can fly between 40 and 60 bucks depending on what you know, what kind of cage are you buying uh, at the end I'm very happy with it I repeat I'm not sponsorized by this I just put these videos do my best to help anyone that like me need uh, some reliable tool and doesn't have an immense uh, budget available this guys work very well ah by the way uh, accuracy uh, and reliability very reliable they did not fail accuracy i double check or cross reference any pressure or electrical like voltage or oil pressure oil temperature things like that i double check and cross reference with them uh, certified instruments and they are very 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 close to reality uh, they deviation is something that don't make me worry at all because we are talking about uh, values that don't even interfere with the regular function of uh, an internal combustion engine so that's the end eh? thank you very much probably the video is a little bit rough but uh, it's gonna help that for sure eh? remember this brand blue shift sorry is a good option Okay, thank you.